Well, Nuno, obviously a very disappointing result. What would you say about the 90 minutes? Poor performance, bad performance. Uh, not too much words, simply that we didn't play good. Man United was stronger than us. What was missing then? What was bad about it? We conceded in a poor way. We lose balls. We allowed counter-attacks. Uh, we're not able to, to really break them. Uh, they were organized. Three centre-halves, difficult. We had a good chance in the beginning, but uh, not well enough. It's an ongoing theme, isn't it? Not being able to break down opponents. Why was it an issue again today against a side that conceded five last yeah, weekend? Could not do it. Could not do it. Uh, we're not able to find the lines, the combinations, uh, the support when we go wide to combine a little bit better in the second half, but not not do enough. Um, the last pass was never there. The finish was never there. So. A bad performance. Yeah. How, how do you fix that, Nuno? Particularly the creative side. Trying, 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 supporting the players, finding solutions, working on the training ground. There's no other way. We have to work harder. How do you get a bit more out of Harry Kane? He's obviously a, a fantastic player, but seems to be struggling to affect games at the moment. No, we have to take uh, the best of all, all, all our players. Not only about Harry. The focus is not on the Aries. All our players. We have to support them, um, help them, find solutions and, and try to make them better. I truly believe that we are better than today. What can you tell us? I know you didn't want to say too much before the game about yeah. the changes you made. But what can you tell us now that the game's done about why you did that? No, we did that Two because changes. Um, we tried to improve uh, what was missing. Trying to with, with Gio, we did a good game against Burnley. Really good game. He's in a good momentum trying to, to find the best out of him. Um, with Ben, a little bit more consistent. Uh, we fortunately didn't work out. And what about that substitution early in the second half with uh, Bergvine replacing Mora? You heard the boos. It didn't get a good reaction within the stadium. Why did you do it? We did it because we wanted to open the pitch and try to 1v1s with Stevie uh, to try and, and break them down with 1v1s instead of too many combinations inside. Okay, so boos when you made that change, boos at half time, boos at full time. What would you say about those supporters, also the supporters that left the stadium? What would you say to them to convince them you're on the right track? No, we're not on the right track. We totally understand the criticism. It's part, it's part of, of football. When the team doesn't perform, the fans suffer, the fans are not happy, and they show they are not happy. It's up to us to, to take it, um, tell them that we try our best, tell them that we are sorry because we didn't perform as we wanted, and we keep on trying. We keep on trying and humbly, in a humble way, ask them to support us all the way. Okay. Thank you for your time. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.